Hi guys, this is Sadiq from Joadman.com and in this video we will show you how to fix the issue wherein the Safari browser is not able to load either the Apple Map website or the Google Map website. So what actually happened was Apple has rolled out a Mac OS Monterey 12.6 update and alongside that it also rolled out the Safari version 16 update. However, after installing the Safari version 16 update, many users have said that they are no longer able to access either the Apple Map website or the Google Map website. So in this video, we'll show you two different methods to fix this issue. First and foremost, you will have to disable the WebGL via Metal feature of Safari. For that, launch the Safari browser and then go to Safari and select Preferences. After that, go to the Advanced tab and check Mark Show Develop menu and menu bar. This will bring up the develop option. Go there, then go to environmental experimental features. Just a minute, select, yeah. Go there, go to experimental features, and then uncheck WebGL via Metal. This should fix the issue. However, if you are on a MacBook Pro and you are still getting this issue, then your next course of action is to disable the automatic graphic switching. For that, you will have to go to the system preferences and select battery. Once you go to the battery menu, you will see a menu something like this. This is the battery menu that you will see. From there, uncheck automatic graphic switching and this should fix the issue. So guys, these were the two different methods through which you could fix the issue of not being able to access the Apple Maps and Google Maps website in Safari. If you have any queries, do let me know in the comment section and please subscribe to this channel for more tips and tricks. Thanks for watching.